Hello everyone, my name is Morton, and we're back with some more Undertale, and uh, this is a thing now. Seems like I can skip Metaton's biologue by turning him around now. What'd you do? Skip. You told Metaton there was something cool behind him. Really? Where? So it actually did that. That's kind of cool. Clever. Very clever. And this just starts you right away. It's, it's a lot better this way. Boast. They say you aren't going to get hit at all. The rating strategy will increase during Metaton's turn. Lights, camera, action. Okay, the feet movement is really awful to dodge, and I'm trying to like move through the thing. Because I'm like so like obsessed with trying to do that. Pose. How did I dodge that? How did I dodge that? Okay, we're instantly eating a glass of junk food. I'm that all everyone craves. Uh, why is that there? Whatever. <laughs> Turn to scop the audience, they're going rooting for your destruction this turn. Smile for the camera! I couldn't even- I- I saw it! Oh my god, I actually saw that it still hit me. You turn and scop the audience, da ba ba ba. Oh, time for a pop quiz. I hope you brought a keyboard. This was an essay question. Going with that. <laughs> Metaton is saving your essay for future use. The room for your instruction is turned, your research really shoved everyone in your heart. Why does it show you by? I wonder if you can get get this at the first try. I doubt it, but it's, anything can be possible. No, it's not. It just it just stops at a certain point of damage. Ooh, I'm just warming up! You can't shoot all of those, I guarantee you, it's impossible to shoot all of those down. Metaton. You say you aren't going to hit at all, and it's going to increase during Metaton's turn, but why are you going on the third floor? Oh god. Metaton. Can you keep up the pace? Oh god, I hope this doesn't screw me over. Better not screw me over. I'm fully freaking concentrated. I know what I'm doing now. I know what I'm doing right now. Lights, camera, bombs! Things are blowing up! Spare. Time for a, a, a union regulated break! Notice me how you can't shoot faster, because it feels like you're supposed to be able to. You've grown so distant, darling. How about another heart to heart? I'm like really trying to train on myself so I don't get hit, because it's really hard to like concentrate on both of these things at the same time. Oh, I got to the same point I did last time, without using as much food. Arms? Who needs arms with legs like these? I'm still going to win! I almost got hit by the <laughs> Oh wow, I'm almost dead. You need to drink food to the presence is disgusting. Whoa. Oh, I actually did it this time. Show must go on. Okay, that was awful. Drama, drama, action! That's not what I was actually said, but you know, whatever. Lights, camera... Enough of this! Do you really want humanity to perish? Or do you just believe in yourself that much? I hate this one specific attack. Haha, <laughs> inspiring. Well, darling, is it me or you? But I think we both already know who's going to win. Witness the true power of humanity star! Oh. I'm trying, re I'm trying really hard to concentrate. But this is hard. This is really hard. Oh my god, the dodging of this is so awkward. I'm about to... <laughs> I didn't die! Holy crap! Eat drug food! <laughs> then, are you the star? Can you really protect humanity? Whoa! Whoa, your heart is attacking me! That's not something I used to! That's not fair! It's like a boss fight in the freaking. Uh... Okay, stop. 
stop hitting me, please. I need to do it again. I'm not risking it this time. I've gotten so far. I'm not freaking risking anything. I've gotten so freaking far. Okay, trying not to get hit, but it's kind of difficult to not get hit. Oh my god! Junk food! <laughs> Okay, I can't even hit it. I can't even hit them. I can't even hit them now. I lost my concentration. Oh god, I'm almost out of food. I hate that I hate that hard attack. It's really difficult to dodge. But I actually hit it at the same time. Like, this game is really difficult with its like bullet tail shit. Like I just don't <sighs> I'm out of food almost. Metaton. Please, Metaton, just, just let me win. Just let me win. I don't. I'm, I'm not. I'm. Like, it's very possible that I'm just not going to be able to do this. I really need to, like, get even more food and shit. Spare. Okay, it's back and forth, back and forth. Okay, I remembered. Okay. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god! Stop! Stop like going on one side! Oh. Stop it, stop it, stop it! I can't even hit you anymore because of that freaking attack! I only have one food left! Oh my god, I'm not gonna be able to make this! I'm really concentrated right now! I'm still talking like a dumbass! Oh, that, that was easy. Okay. This is not so easy because they're just gonna bullet tell me I'm gonna die. Stop, 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 stop. Oh, they dodged that! Oh my god, I'm so dead! Okay. I... This is my last... This is my last freaking chance, man. And I already got hit again. This is not a good start. Please die, please die, please die! Okay. Just shoot randomly and concentrate on dodging. That's what I need to do right now, just shoot randomly. How are you still alive?! Oh look at these ratings! This is the most viewers I've ever had! Did I actually make it? I've reached a viewer calling milestone! One lucky viewer will have the chance to talk to me before I leave the underground forever. Let's see who calls in first. Hi, you're on TV. What do you have to say on this, our last show? Oh. Hi, Metaton. I really liked watching your show. My life's pretty boring, but seeing you on the screen brought excitement to my life, vicariously. I can't tell, but I guess this is the last episode? I'll miss you, Metaton. Oh, I didn't mean to talk so long. Oh, uh, you know what that is? That that was an absolute look. Wait, wait, blue. They they already hung up. I'll take another caller, Metaton. Your show made us so happy, Metaton. I don't know when I'll watch without you, Metaton. There's a Metaton shit holding my Metaton shit arch. Ah, uh, I I see. Everyone, thank you so much. Darling, perhaps it might be better if I stay here for a while. Humans already have stars and idols, but monsters, they only have me. If I left the underground, would lose its spark. I'd leave an aching void that can never be filled. So, I think I'll have to delay my big debut. Besides, you proved to be very strong. Perhaps even strong enough to get past Askul. I'm sure you'll be able to protect humanity. Haha. <laughs> It's all for the best anyway. The truth is, this form's energy consumption is inefficient. In a few moments, I'll run out of battery power and... Well, I'll be alright. Knock him dead, darling. And everyone, thank you! You've been a great audience!
I, I managed to open the lock. Are you two? <coughs> oh my god. Metaton! Metaton, are you... Thank God, it's just the batteries. Metaton, if you were God, I would have... I would have... I mean, hey, it's not a, it's not a problem, you know? It's just a robot, if you messed it up, I could always just build another. Why don't you go on ahead? Um, can I not go back and get more food? Oh shit, I'm screwed. I have no food. I have absolutely no food. If this is like some important part of the... <coughs> Sorry about that. Let's let's keep going. So you're about to meet Asgore, huh? You must you must be p pretty excited about all that, huh? You'll f finally you'll finally get to go home. W wait. I mean, uh, I, I was just going to, uh, say goodbye and, uh, I can't take this anymore. I, I lied to you. A human soul isn't strong enough to cross the barrier alone. It takes at least a human soul, and a monster soul. If you want to go home, you'll have to take his soul. You'll have to kill Asgore. I'm sorry. Can I not like, get food before going here? Because <coughs> I kind of need food. Is this glitched out or is it supposed to take this long? I honestly can't tell. Okay, it's not glitched out. Oh no. Castle elevator. Oh god. Oh, can I go back? There is any use. No! No! Please! Oh god, this. Yeah, this. this wow, that's actually kind of fancy. If you, like, look at it in a specific way, it looks like the, uh, the whole town is, like, spinning. <coughs> I'm, like, literally, I don't even. I, have, I only have full health. Yeah, I'm supposed to fight Asgore. I need more food. I don't get how I'm supposed to be able to get any food if I can't even go back. Is there a chest somewhere? Oh no. Oh, come on. It's just another version of the same house. It's a golden flower. It's a photo album, scrapbooks, books now to make tea. A long time ago, a human fell into the ruins. Injured by its fall, the human called out for help. I don't think I like this. You took the key and put it on your phone's keychain. Fridge is full of unopened containers of snails. Asriel, the king's son, heard the human's call. He brought the human back to the castle. The heart shaped locket inside the box. Will you take it? Yes. Got the heart shaped locket. There's a worn dagger inside the box. Will you take it? Take the worn dagger. Worn dagger, weapon attack. Oh wow. Might as well equip that. Equip the worn dagger. And what I had was Teth Yes. Heart locket, armor. Oh wow. I'm going to use you. Equip the locket. What do I have on me? Stain apron? What's that? Stain apron, it heals you. Oh, I don't know if I wanna... I mean, I wanted to use both of them, but I just can't. I obviously can't. Renovations. Oh, wow. Tutorial is on the renovations now. Renovations, rather. Over time, Astral and the human became like siblings. The king and queen treated the human child as their own. The underground was full of hope. the key and put on your phone's keychain. 
It's a trophy. Trophy. Number one, Nose Lassel Champs 98. It's a close drawer. There are robes, button up shirts, and a pink hand knit sweater that says Mr. Dad Guy. Ah. It's a bureau. There's a Santa Claus outfit inside. It's a king sized bed. <laughs> it's Asgore's journal. All the current page says is it's a nice day today. The ink is still almost wet. Despite everything, it's still you. There's gotta be some freaking final boss fight or something. Uh, I don't have any food, so I'm kinda worried. <laughs> then, one day, the human became very ill. The sick human had only one request, to see the flowers from their village. But there was nothing we could do. The next day, the next day, the human died. Azrael, racked with grief, absorbed the human soul. He transformed into a being with incredible power. <clears throat> with the human soul, Azrael crossed through the barrier. He carried the human's body into the sunset, back to the village of the humans. Azrael reached the center of the village. There, he found a bed of golden flowers. He carried the human onto it. I've never even seen this monster before, what? Suddenly, screams rang out. The villagers saw Asriel holding the human's body. They thought that he had killed him, they killed the child. The humans attacked him with everything they had. He was struck with blow after blow. Asriel had the power to destroy them all. But Asriel did not fight back. Clutching the human, Asriel smiled and walked away. <laughs> Wounded, Asriel stumbled home. He entered the castle and collapsed. His dust spread across the garden. It was say land, but... <coughs> the kingdom fell into despair. The king and queen had lost two children in one night. The humans had once again taken everything from us. The king decided it was time to end our suffering. Every human who falls down here must die. With enough souls, we can shatter the barrier and forever. It's not long now. King Asgore will let us get will let us go, will give us hope, will save us all. You should be smiling, too. Aren't you excited? Aren't you happy? You're going to be free. Can I use this a little bit? I can! Let me put it back here though. Can I even go back? Can I even go back? Can I actually go back? Because I kinda need the food. The thing was closed though. If it's open now, I'll be happy because then I can actually get food, but this is a high chance that it isn't. Or I guess there's not really a high chance, but there's, there's always a chance that they did not set it up like that. And they didn't think about, oh, you actually need some extra food to be able to survive that final fight and stuff. Oh, yes, it's open! Oh, thank Jeebus.
I got some junk food. Actually, I want to kind of talk to this guy. Okay, he doesn't have anything. I need to talk to Caddy and Brady then, because he talked about some like stuff he did with them and then stuff. I want to like kind of do that stuff. <laughs> That's a very specific thing I'm saying right now. That stuff. I know. Want some junk food. I have 999 burger pants. Oh, that guy from the store. Yuck, what a creep. Yeah, he's a creep. But he's got a cute too. Come on, Caddy, don't, don't you have any standards? Nope. Okay, like, the annoying thing is, he'd be okay if he just treated us with some respect. He just acts really weird. <clears throat> and then acts like it's our fault he acts that way. Like, when we asked him to get those hamburgers, he dropped them and ran away before he can even say anything. We were, like, going to share them. Really? I wasn't. Catty. Can I sell anything to you? Thanks, but we, like, don't really need anything. You don't really need anything. Wait, I'll pay you one... Tyson G, if you get a metaton to grab my butt. <laughs> um, I guess just drop those things then? But I don't want to drop one of them. Like, um, I want to drop the tough glove because obviously it's not going to be anything better. But I kind of want to put it away in the chest too. I'll just drop it. I want to keep the apron on me. Just to, like, in case. I need the food too, so I need to like take all the proportions here. Cause you know, a final boss battle with like no health, uh, I mean no healing stuff is not a good idea. Betting caddy. The girls are all talking about me? They say I should stop acting like they owe me. And if I wanted to be friends with them, I should just uh, try to see things from their perspective? Wow. Poor naive little buddy. They brainwashed you. Friendship is just a hot, hot person's way of making you their slave. So, uh, what time would they want to hang out? Oh, that's seriously have to go back and forth all the time. I don't really want to do that. But I guess I need to like respond by going here. Makes sense. Oh, uh, yeah, he should come and look for drunk with us. But like, if he let him hang out with us, just the way it will be really super fun. Um, that was not what I was gonna say, but it was close, right? Well, that kind of guy. You hang out with him once, and then he wants to hang out all the time. Don't you feel bad for him, Braddy? Poor burger pants. Think about how cool we're compared to him. We'd be saving his life with our friendship. His life, Braddy. Uh, so? Think of all the glamourers he could get for us. So is he free after work? I want to be like, because I I don't I don't know why, why I keep repeating stuff when I already done it before. I just like like talking, I guess. They want to hang out after work. I can guess I won't let you down, little buddy. Thank you. You brought it here to the eye of this old man. So uh, where do they want to go? They want to hang out to the garbage dump. Well, nowhere to go but upright, little buddy. Upright. Yeah, whatever. I said that wrong. <laughs> There's a lot of things I say wrong if I just read it, you know. That's just in the human nature. Can't really do anything about it. Okay, there's no more to say. So there's no more to say. So this is gonna hang out and have fun, whatever. I'll go back to like fighting the final boss. <laughs> and like, not dying hopefully. Not a lot anyway. We're back. Right back where we went. Whatever. <laughs> that sentence made very little sense for some reason. I'm happy it doesn't take as long this time than it did the first time to go up because it took like almost half a minute to just to get up here. It was awful. I keep clicking that several times, and it's really annoying, sorry. Uh, oh, yeah, let's try to do this, and then I'm already there. Yay! Damn it! Let's go. Save here, too. Now, 
what the fuck, Sans. That's so clearly Sans. What is he doing here? So you finally made it. The end of your journey is at hand. In a few moments, you will meet the king. Together, you will determine the future of this world. That's then, now. You will be judged. You will be judged for every action. You will be judged for every XP you've earned. What's XP? It's an acronym. It stands for Execution Points. A way of quantifying the pain you have inflicted on others. When you kill someone, your XP increases. When you have enough XP, your love increases. Love, too, is an acronym. It stands for a level of violence. A way of measuring someone's capacity to hurt. The more you kill, the easier it becomes to distance yourself. The more you distance yourself, the less you will hurt. The more easily we can bring yourself to hurt others. But you, you'll never gain any love. Of course, that doesn't mean you're completely innocent or naive. It's that you kept that certain tenderness in your heart. No matter the struggles or hardships you faced, you strive to do the right thing. You refused to hurt anyone. Even when you ran away, you did it with a smile. You never gained love, but you gained love. Does that make sense? Maybe not. Now, you're about to face the greatest challenge of your entire journey. Your actions here will determine the fate of the entire world. If you refuse to fight, Asgard will take your soul and destroy humanity. But if you kill Asgard and go home, monsters will remain trapped underground. What will you do? Well, if I were you, I would have thrown in the towel by now. But you didn't get this far by giving up, did you? That's right. You have something called determination. So as long as you hold on, so as long as you do what's in your heart, I believe you can do the right thing. Alright, we're all counting on you, kid. Good luck. This is it, eh? Not a whole way. This does not make me feel comfortable. Throne room. What's down here? Oh no. It's a coffin. There's a name engraved on it. Loopy. It's empty. Shit! This is this is this is too much, man. Too much. Let's go. Oh, is someone there? Just a moment. I have almost finished what watering these flowers. Here we are. Howdy. How can I... Oh. I so badly wanted to say, would you like a cup of tea? But, you know how it is. So quite clearly, Toriel is his husband. And she's the queen. Nice day today, huh? Birds are singing. Flowers are blooming. Blooming? Blooming. Perfect weather for a game of catch. You know what we must you know what you know what we must do. When you are ready, come into the next room. It's time to freaking do this shit. It's a throne. It's another throne covered by a white sheet. That was obviously Toriel's throne. I guess they divorced or whatever they do in this world. How tense. Just think of it like a visit to the dentist. Are you ready? If you are not, I understand. I'm not ready either. Is 
This is the barrier. This is what keeps us all trapped underground. If, if by chance you have any unfinished business, please do what you must. I see. Is this is it then. Ready? Strange light fills the room. Twilight is shining through the barrier. It seems your journey is finally over. You're filled with determination. Human, it was nice to meet you. Goodbye. Oh shit! Oh no, he removed the mercy button! Quietly tell Asko you don't want to fight him. His hands tremble for a moment. You tell Asko you don't want to fight him. His breathing gets funny for a moment. Firm it till Asko to stop fighting. Recollection flashed in his eyes. Asko's attack dropped. Asko's defense dropped. Wow! I need to eat. I need to eat right over. No, 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 no! That's what I was trying to do! Oh, I'm so dead. Uh, eat! It's what I was trying to do. Seems talking won't do any more good. Oh, God. I guess you have to fight. Ay, 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 fuck! <coughs> I've never even fought in this game before. I didn't even know how the mechanic works. I must say, this music is freaking amazing, though. It really pumps you up for this. Time to eat. Eat if drunk food, your herbs are most maxed out. Ooh. Oh god, this is the this is the game over screen music. Didn't even realize until now. Okay, that one's pretty easy to remember. How did I not get hit? Holy crap, I must be like a god at dodging. Why did I just do that? <laughs> I, say th I say I'm a god at dodging and then I completely fail the attack. I might actually die here. I need to eat right away. He's drunk for the recovery chain HP. Come on. We ha we fucking we have this. Oh my god. I say I should get destroyed by this attack. I wanna risk it. I'm not gonna waste food, so I'm just gonna risk it. Oh wow. What am I doing? Go back! What am I doing? Okay, it's just that attack. I almost just died. Because I didn't eat. Eat the drunk food, you're covered in shame HP. Oh. Mm. Uh. Fucking fight! Oh god, my damage is going up in numbers too. This is freaking it, bro. This fucking. This is it. I'm fucking pumped up, bro.
that attack's pretty easy. I'm glad it's not that hard, because or else I'll be dead like earlier. Oh no, not this attack again. I was expecting a different attack. I was expecting a different attack. <laughs> Eat. God damn it. Eat the junk food. I'm surprised how good I'm doing at this. I was expecting to suck entirely, like, seriously. I did it. Uh. So that is how it is. I remember the day after my son died. The entire underground was devoid of hope. The future had once again been taken from us by the humans. In a fit of anger, I declared war. I said that I would destroy any human that came here. I would use their souls to become godlike and free us from this terrible prison. Then I would destroy humanity and let monsters rule the surface in peace. Soon, the people's hope returned. My wife, however, became disgusted with my actions. She left this place, never to be seen again. That explains the uh, covered-up throne. Fruitfully, I do not want power. I do not want to hurt anyone. I just wanted everyone to have hope. But I cannot take this any longer. I just want to see my wife. I just want to see my child. Please, young one. This war has gone long enough. You have the power. Take my soul and leave this cursed place. No, I will not. After everything I've done to you, to hurt you, you would rather stay down here and suffer than live happily on the surface? Human, I promise you, for as long as you remain here, my wife and I will take care of you as best we can. You can sit in the living room, telling stories, eating butterscotch pie. We, would, we could be like, like a family. No, 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 no! No! What the fuck? Fuck you, Flowey! You idiot! You haven't learned a thing in this world. It's kill or be killed. Oh, fuck you, you fucking asshole. The game turned off. Um, I'll turn it back on, I guess. What the hell? Like, I'm just like sitting on Steam right now because it turned off. What? One day. Wait. Oh. The even the the game window is changing names. What the? Now it's called Flowey Tail? What the... Bloody hell! Oh f... What the f... No! Fuck you, Flowey. Fuck you so much. Howdy. It's me, Flowey. Flowey the Flower! Oh, you huge spanks! You really did a number of that old fool. Without you, I never could have pa gotten past him. Oh, fuck you. But now, with your help, he's dead. And I've got the human souls! <laughs> Actually, just made me have chills right now. Boy! I've been empty for so long. It feels great to have a soul inside me again. Mmm, I can feel them wriggling. Ah, you're feeling left out, aren't you? Well, that's just perfect. After all, I only have six souls. I still need one more. Before I become God. And then, with my newfound powers. Monsters. Humans. Everyone. I'll show them all the real meaning of this world. Oh, and forget about escaping to your old save file. It's gone forever. But don't worry. Your old friend Flowey 
has worked out a replacement for you. I'll save you over your own death, so you can watch me tear you to bloody pieces over and over and over. What? Do you really think you can stop me? <laughs> you really are an idiot. I don't like this shit. Oh fuck. Oh shit. Well then, what the fuck? Um, can we just not? Can we not? Can we fucking not? No! What the f- Can we just not, please? Can we just not? Stop! I'm dead. So, what the fuck? This is all just a bad dream. No, it's not. And you're never waking up! <coughs> the game shut off again. This is some bullshit. And now get Steam's freezing up. That's definitely not a part of the game. <laughs> Did you really think I was gonna be satisfied killing you only one time? Son of a fuck. Oh, it's fucking on now. I got my fucking game face on. You're so fucked. Bring it, you motherfucking bitch. That's a different attack? What? This is not the same as before. God, this is- oh no! I'm not good at dodging shit like this. I get to act. Call for help. Oh wow! Oh god. Okay. That helps. Oh god, the face on the screen! It changed! That is absolutely terrifying. Everything in this game is terrifying, why am I kidding? Four damage? And this is supposed to be possible to beat? I call bullshit on that. Is it possible? I wonder if it's even possible to die. I don't even know. I want it to not be possible. To be completely honest. Oh, fuck me. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, there's Act. Can I even get there in time? Call for help. Please work. Please work. Why oh, can't I get him in time? Oh no, I didn't get anything on that. <coughs> Why does it keep spawning there? It's actually screwing my whole, like, dodging maneuvers. Warning. What the fu- Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Actually, can I actually die from this? I can't- I can't tell. 
Call for help, he calls for help. I got most of it anyway. Oh my god! This is awful! Fight! I'm doing a lot better than I did last time, I guess. But still, what the hell? Oh my god. This is actually like the worst thing I've ever experienced in my life! Ah! I've never experienced anything worse than the- Oh my god. This is this is this is what you call like quality terrifying boss. I mean like specifically in video games, this is the most terrible terrifying thing ever. Not just like real life, that would be dumb. Oh god. Act! You called for help! Stop dodging me. I got almost- I only got half health back there. Oh god. Stop spawning there, that's really screwing me over, I don't like it. It's trying to like, judge my movements and then go all- what? In front of me? That just- that just skipped back. What the hell is going on? Oh my god. Oh. Oh fuck. Oh shit. Oh tits. Oh. Come on, come on. You make it. Act, act. You go for help. <coughs> give us mags, give us mags, give us mags. What the. Okay. That does so much damage right now. Oh my flies into a fly trap thing with jig. <clears throat> 25 damage, it's definitely going up. It's going up so slow. I don't want to do this so much more. It's, Cause this is like mud and ah Okay. Bullet hell definition of bullet hell this game is just the definition of it. What the hell? That was an interesting attack. <laughs> Oh, you call for help! I got hit anyway. I can't even. Can't, I, 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 what? I, I, I didn't pick up a save going on! I'm so. Never mind. Oh shit. Oh, never mind. They're gonna heal me anyway. Fucking flower is so goddamn dead. <clears throat> Sko! Up to zero. That helps. Oh wow. Oh, this is. Oh my god, I'm getting hit by every single one now. I like, actually die at this point. Okay, I found a better way to dodge, dodge them. A lot better. Just stay on the bottom of the screen and don't let him like actually hit you. Oh wow! <laughs> I'm getting so screwed over here. Go back to fight. Oh wow, this is if if anything's bullet hell in this world, then this is just legitimate bullet hell. <coughs> And I, I'm not usually that good at bullet hell games, but I guess this game is an exception. Or else I'm just... I don't know how this game... Oh god, I didn't even pick up the health. I'm almost dead too. I'm actually losing a lot of health. Die! Die, you sick son of a bitch! Die! Die, you motherfucker! Ugh. That was... that was... 
Wow. This can't be happening! You! You! <coughs> oh, are you fucking serious? You idiot! Uh, are you fucking with me? you really think you could defeat me? I am the gods of this world, and you, you're hopeless, hopeless and alone. Golly, that's right. Your worthless friends can't save you now. Call for help, I dare you. Cry into the darkness. Mommy, Daddy, somebody help! See what good it does for you. We call for help. But nobody came. Boy, what a shame. Nobody else is gonna get to see you die. Save me. Oh. Well, that was correct, I guess. <coughs> what? How'd you... Well, I'll just... Load failed. Wh what? Where are my powers? The souls? What are they doing? No! No! You can't do that! You're supposed to obey me! Stop! Stop it! Stop! Fucking pacifist motherfucker. What are you doing? Do you really think I'll learn any from this? No. Sparing you won't change anything. Killing me is the only way to end this. No. If you let me live, I'll come back. Nope, you won't. I'll kill you. I'll kill everyone. I'll kill everyone you love. Why? Why are you being so nice to me? I can't understand. I can't understand. I just can't understand. <coughs> Flower ran away. Sorry, Flower ran away. You deserve everything you you deserve to fucking die, but I'm a pacifist, so I don't give a fuck. Wait, what? Isn't that like the entrance? By Toby Fox. Was that the... Is this the, the, the credits? Temi Chang. Tylerist, Kenju, Merigu, Magnolia Porter. A lot of names. Muffet is made by Michelle. Cool. Good to know. She's a cool. She's a, she's a cool person. I mean, spider woman. I don't know. Stephanie McIntyre as guitarist. I guess. Have I escaped now? Is that the thing? Ring, ring. Hey, -o. is anyone there? Well, I'll just leave a message. So it's been a while. The queen returned and is now ruling over the underground. She stands dead in the new policy. All the humans who followed her, her will be treated not as enemies, but as friends. It's probably for the best anyway. The human souls the king gathered seem to have disappeared. So, uh, that plan ain't happening anytime soon. But even though people are, <laughs> oh, wow, are heartbroken over the king, and things are looking grim for our freedom, the queen's trying her best not to let us give up hope. So, uh, hey, if we're not up giving up down here, don't give up wherever you are, okay? Who knows how long it'll take. We will get out of here. Sans! Who are you talking to? Oh, nobody. What? Nobody? Can I talk to them too? Here, knock yourself out. Wait a second. 
I recognize this number! Attention, human! I, the Great Papyrus, am now captain of the Royal Guard! It's everything I've ever dreamed of! Except, instead of fighting, we just water flowers. So that's ever so slightly different. And we're helping with off office and the research. research. <laughs> She's gonna find a new way to get us out of here. And Dine is helping her too. Though, to be honest, her medic helping is, seems kind of explosion inducing. But I think Alphys likes having her around. Uh oh! Hey, what are you up to, punk? Yeah! Please don't look at the phone! Hey, who's in charge here? Me! Oh, yeah. That's right. <laughs> I quit my job as leader of the Royal Guard. Actually, since we won't be fighting anymore, the Royal Guard actually disbanded. There's uh, only one member now. But it is extremely good! Yeah! He is! Come here! Please don't nugget the skeleton! Anyways, now I'm working as Alphys lab assistant. We're gonna find a way out of this dump. Once and for all. Oh yeah, and I'm a gym teacher at the Queen's New School. Did you know I can bench press seven children? Awesome, right? Yeah. Hey. I'm sorry about what happened with Ascor. You were just doing what you had to. It's not your fault he... Ah, darn it. I missed the big guy. Come on, Undyne. Snap out of it. Uh, I guess I'll tell you how Alphys is doing. Well, she's the same as ever. Maybe a little more reclusive than normal. Seems like something's really bothering her. If she can, she can get through it, I'm here supporting her. That's what friends are for, right? Hey, wherever you are, I hope it's better than here. It took a lot of sacrifice for you to get there. So wherever you are, you have to try to be happy, okay? For our sakes. We'll feel better knowing our, our trouble was worth it. We're all with you. Everyone is. Even the queen. Hey, wait a second. Toriel, Toriel, do you wanna... Hey, <laughs> she says she's busy. But if she knew who we were talking to... We wouldn't get a phone back for at least a few hours. Have we have the mercy to spare you from her. But call back any time, okay? She loved to talk. Oh, whoops. This thing's almost out of barriers. So I had to cut this short, but... Be seeing you, okay, buddy? Bye bye for now! See ya, punk! Why the fuck are you back? Go away. Why? Why did you let me go? Don't you realize that being nice just makes you get hurt? Look at yourself. You made all these great friends, but now you'll probably never see them again. Not to mention how much they've been set back to you. Hurts, doesn't it? If you'd just gone back through without caring about anyone, you wouldn't have to feel bad now. If you click the keyboard real quick. So I don't get it. If you really did everything the right way, why did things still end up like this? Why? Is life really that unfair? Say, what if I told you I need some way to get you a better ending? You'd have to load your save file and, well, in the meantime, why don't you go see Dr. Alphys? It seems like you could have been better friends. Who knows? Maybe she's got the key to your happiness. See you soon. So I guess we're not actually done then. Is this just a normal intro? So then skip it, then go back to the... Okay, whatever. <coughs> so I guess if, it's, if we load our save file at this point... If we load our save file... Uh, sorry, I started off the game. Uh, I actually wrote something on the screen when I've been like doing the outro. I didn't expect I didn't expect it to instantly turn off like it did. That was kind of dumb. Sorry. Uh, oh God, Steam, not now. Please work. But like I was saying, so we are next episode, which I thought is not going to be our next episode, but there apparently is now because we're we're going to load our save file. Go talk to Alphys and see what happens from there. I mean, wouldn't just give me that big like, oh, you want a happy ending? Do this shit. Without actually having a happy ending, so. Don't do that. God damn. But anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed. Wow, that, that was a roller coaster to say the least. That's insane. Uh, if you enjoyed, please leave a like. You can subscribing. Tell what you think of this, uh, this game. Especially with this insane like what the hell ending
And, like, I love this game so much. Yeah, I'm just gonna keep skipping that. But I love this game so much. And I only played it one... I only had one playthrough. I can only say this is one of the greatest game of, games I've ever played in my life. But until next time, guys. Have a good day. And I'll see you in the next episode of Undertale. Bye, guys.